All right, so one of these things is not like the other. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> So here's the deal. The Rockets need some help making Toyota Center one of the loudest venues in the NBA. The Red Rowdies are back for another season looking for a few new recruits. Chris Lord is leading the charge. Yes, Good Tom. Morning to you. Good morning. How are you? I am well. For people who have not been to a game and have experienced the Red Rowdies, give me a, an idea what, what you guys are all about. From the second you get into Toyota Center, mm -hmm. you will hear the Rowdies. What we do is we, we do a big romp around the arena, upstairs and downstairs, just mm -hmm. to get the fans excited once they step into Toyota Center. When the game tips off, that's when everything increases. I mean, the energy is amped up. We're one with the Rockets team, and mm -hmm. we're one with the rest of the fans that are there uh, in the arena. So the loudest venue in the, in the league? The loudest. We are, uh, we are mm -hmm. uh, a best practice in the NBA. I mean, we started this fan group back in 2006, and, mm -hmm. uh, and lots of other NBA teams have uh, kind of spawned and, and got and developed their own group. Now, Marissa, you are... Uh I'm dressed. Oh, you are dressed. <laughs> well, this is your normal attire, isn't it? Oh, of course. Of course. Always got to spell All right. Sport. What does it take to be a rowdy? Energy, uh, commitment, just be a great big fan, passionate, uh -huh. be passionate about the game, um, just support our Rockets. And as your uh, other cohorts uh, suggest, comfortable yeah. in your own skin, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so, uh, so there are uh, auditions, because you could auditions. always use more rowdies. Yes. Oh. Um, Tell me. Saturday, October the 9th at 3.30 in front of Toyota Center, we're mm -hmm. looking for 50 rowdies. We're looking for the 50 craziest rowdies, most diehard Rockets fans. Okay. And they will receive the grand prize uh -huh. of free Rockets season tickets, Tom. Free and season tickets! Each of them. Uh, each, each of them. Each of the 50 yeah. rowdies we select will receive season tickets. And, Tom, you know this season's going to be amazing. It's going to be awesome. You know what? In part because Ooh. the big man is coming back. Mr. Yao Ming, Mr. 7 foot 6 will be back. Uh -huh. A little excitement. Yeah, yeah, no, totally. And the, the mm -hmm. entire Rockets organization and staff, as well as the fans, mm -hmm. are really excited about this season. And I, I smell something special. I smell something really special. Do you this year. smell what the Rockets are cooking. Yeah. 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 The Red Rowdies, and again, uh, the uh, the recruits, the auditions are available to you. It is October. Ninth audition Saturdays at three thirty. If you are the loudest, 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 <laughs> craziest, <laughs> rowdiest rocket fans in Houston, you could win the uh, grand prize of season tickets, as Chris says, and you could call yourself, and this may even be greater, you could call yourself a red rowdy. Red rowdy. <laughs> so, one, one final question: uh, Do these guys all have to re-audition? They have to. Yes, yeah. they all have to. Re all right. Even Darth Rowdy back here. Darth has to Rowdy. Yeah. Yeah. All right. <laughs> so, all right. So, Natalie Bomke, as you uh, as you think about being a Red Rowdy, and you know your outfit kind of resembles it to yeah. some degree. You're gonna have to put up with uh, with with the likes of this. I was gonna say that one guy in the back looks like he's from Texas Chainsaw Massacre. <laughs> I watch your back there. The guy in the jumpsuit. Yeah.